Docker Desktop Welcome to Learn Computer Technology. This is the tutorial series for Docker Desktop installation. In this series we will learn about 1. Introduction to Docker Desktop 2. Installation of Docker Desktop in Windows 11 OS 3. Installation of Docker in Ubuntu OS This series is divided into three parts of tutorial as Part 1. Introduction to Docker Desktop In this part of tutorial, we will learn Brief Introduction about Docker Desktop Features of Docker Desktop Part 2 Installation of Docker Desktop in Windows OS This part includes Creation of Docker Account Online Download of Docker Desktop for Window Prerequisite Hardware Requirement Prerequisite Enable Features of Windows 11 OS Installation of Docker Desktop Basic Operation in Docker Interface and PowerShell Installation of Pi Hole in Docker Desktop Part 3. Installation of Docker in Ubuntu OS. This part includes creation of Docker account, online download of Docker for Ubuntu, prerequisite hardware requirement, installation of Docker, basic operation in Docker using Bash shell, installation of Pi hole in Docker. Here, we start with the part 1. Introduction to Docker Desktop. Docker Desktop is an easy-to-install application for your Linux or Windows environment that enables you to build and share containerized applications and microservices. Docker Desktop includes Docker Engine, Docker CLI Client, Docker Compose, Docker Content Trust, Kubernetes, and Credential Helper. You can find details in given URL, https colon slash slash github.com slash docker slash docker dash credential dash helper slash Features of Docker Desktop Some of the key features of Docker Desktop include 1. Ability to containerize and share any application on any cloud platform, in multiple languages and frameworks. 2. Easy installation and setup of a complete Docker development environment. 3. Includes the latest version of Kubernetes. 4. Automatic updates to keep you up to date and secure. 5. On Windows, the ability to toggle between Linux and Windows server environments to build applications. 6. Fast and reliable performance with native Windows Hyper-V virtualization. 7. Ability to work natively on Linux through Windows Subsystem for Linux 2, WSL2, on Windows machines. 8. Volume mounting for code and data, including file change notifications and easy access to running containers on the local host network. 9. In container development and debugging with supported IDEs. This is the brief introduction of Docker. We will do and learn more in next parts of this series. Hope you have learned and understand the topic. Please like, share, subscribe and express your views in comment for our motivation. Thanks for watching.